This is a 3.8 S-Type Jaguar engine from around 1965. It came to me from a customer in France. He attempted to drive it initially from London to Paris and unfortunately en route the head gasket failed. It was discovered that that was due to corrosion in the water galleries of the cylinder head. Probably as a result of it standing for a very long time without the correct antifreeze mixture in it. So the cylinder head had to be welded up and remachined. Similarly, the block face was skimmed to take the corrosion away from the block face. Um, the general condition of the engine was not too bad at all, really. The crankshaft had been reground to plus 10 thou, but unfortunately, I think it had been built dirtily because there were score marks on the new bearings that had been fitted, so it had to be reground to plus 20 thou new bearings fitted. Oddly, they'd replaced the pistons in it, but hadn't reboard the engine, so as a result, of course, the skirts of the of the pistons became scored due to the score marks in the bore. Obviously, it's been reboard to plus 20 and new pistons fitted. One of the con rods was massively overweight in comparison to the other by, by as much as 28 grams. The tolerance being three, so that is rather, rather serious. The usual work was done on the cylinder head with regards to the valve guys and valve seats, and it had new valves fitted as well as new tappets. The owner said that the engine had remained stripped down in this garage in France for nine years and some of the parts had gone missing. Oddly, it was the parts that are quite rare that you can't buy off the shelf, including the oil filter assembly, the fuel feed pipe and the water pump front pulley, which of course I had to source and refurbish them all. So let's start it up.